Mr. Dennis, uh, one of the Nixon administration goals has been to kind of uh, streamline the post office department around the country, maybe take it out of the patronage system. Do you think uh, there's any progress towards that goal so far? Well, yes, I think there is. Uh, Postmaster General came down to a meeting of the House Republicans and told us about the new program and the new regulations, and as I understand it, the idea is to take congressional influence and appointments completely out and put these matters on more or less a merit basis, and appointment within the service and examinations by various boards at various levels and so forth in an effort to run the Postal Service on a basis of efficiency rather than a basis of politics. Personally, I think it's a step in the right direction. Some of my colleagues are upset about it. Naturally, it's understandable. Democrats have been in control a long time. This will leave a lot of Democrats in office, I assume. And there's a natural inclination to more or less make a change first and then get religion, so to speak. But personally, I, uh, I think it's all right. I think if we can do anything to make the Postal Service more efficient, it's a good thing. And I have a feeling that the people are ready for it. I think maybe it's an idea whose time has come. I don't think the, most of the people are not too interested in the political angle of it. They want an efficient postal department. And if we actually begin to get that as a result, I think everybody will be satisfied. Another Nixon campaign uh, issue was the crime issue, and you attended a conference today, an Anderson uh, crime conference with lo local law enforcement agencies. Is there much progress being made in this uh, area by the Nixon administration? Well, of course, it's early yet. Uh, I think the president has indicated that he didn't intend to uh, cut the budget uh, where crime was involved very much at all. There are a lot of bills in the hopper down there to uh, strengthen law enforcement of one kind and another. Most of them naturally have to deal with federal offenses in the federal courts and so on. Some of them, however, do uh, envisage more financial aid to the states and localities, including even proposals to help salaries in some of the larger cities uh, for policemen. And uh, there's some very interesting bills in there uh, directed at organized crime, which of course is one of our uh, big problems. Uh, 